高雄捷运公司与高雄市政府新建营运合约的规定，必须在车站内设置公共艺术。它主要的目的在于美化建筑物及环境。Existence is really a mystery. It can't be understood, really. But this dome is my attempt to make people feel this mystery. The work is 30 meters across, but there are places where I'm actually working on four square centimeters, and I'm very aware of what I'm doing in four square centimeters. It's like a grain of sand in a huge beach, but I want the viewer to feel what I feel, which is there is very small things that one has inside, a dimension of minute proportions. And then there is very large things that you have inside, which mirrors the way actually the universe really is. The reason for glass is because it's a very ancient material. It is also a very new material because the 20th century, the chemistry and the physics uh, has changed the property of the glass, so made it become a new artist's medium. It's actually done like this. My art is created in a volcano. That's the origin of my art. This volcano spills the material that is shaped into the archetypal images that the painter in me has imagined. If an individual looks at a single painting, you have a one-to-one -one experience between an artist and a, and, and a public. But when a large work is placed in the center of a city, then it is a very large transfer of energy. The quality an artist should have is to express life, express thoughts, express feelings sincerely and honestly and very sensitively. My work is like an opera. And an opera is a very complex uh, endeavor. It has many, many, many actors, many singers, many, many things happen in opera, but they all happen on a stage and with a theme. So my theme, I felt, should be simple and very easy to grasp. The entire work happens in a spiral and then inside that spiral I will place all of the symbols and all of the sub-stories and sub-stories and sub-stories but they're all part of the fabric of this galaxy. Apart from the artistic invention there is a logistical management problem in making a project like this, which has monumental proportion. We have never had such a wonderful design. And from an artist coming from Italy, living in Mexico, being an American, uh, looking for the best studio, hopefully what he could find is ours. And, and so we are doing that with an art consultant uh, who is absolute experience and this is this is a wonderful collaboration I think and I enjoy that. Um, the dome has a thousand one hundred and fifty five panels 
each one must be kept track of. Each one we must be able to see at the snap of a finger. I put this needle into the panel here to, uh, to show that this panel has been painted. His ability to keep track and control this project makes me free to do the artistic work. It is a very really big challenge for me to get the overview of this project because when you work on it, you always work in small pieces and small pieces and usually you don't ever work that big anyway. So you work on small pieces and then you have to put them together and then they have to fit and then they have to look good. And sometimes you don't even know what you're working at. His artwork will work colorful, beautiful artwork will give this the city of Kaohsiung, which is a very industrial port city, and give the people of Kaohsiung, who are very, uh, most of engineers and hardworking industrious people, a place to think, a place to enjoy, a place to have fun, a place to dream.